Okay, Todd, why don't you speak of some of the incredible vehicle stats that really give the Hummer EV its serious off-road capability? We have ground clearance of 15.9 inches, an approach angle of 49.7 degrees, and a departure angle of 38.4 degrees. Vertical wall climb greater than 18 inches, and water fording capability 32 inches. One of the Hummer EV's amazing features is its available extract mode, which provides up to six inches of additional suspension lift. Well, and it's not just about getting out of the toughest situations, it's also about confidently being able to tackle just about any type of low-speed off-road terrain. The team has done a great job taking our drive modes to the next level. Terrain mode and off-road mode specifically will be huge enablers. We also spent a lot of time working on the acceleration response to make the truck very precise in technical situations. It gives you access to the 11,500 pound-feet of torque. Well, I'm sure you have many experiences going over punishing terrain where the sound of rock scraping against the undercarriage makes you cringe, right? You're absolutely right, Al. The team has done an incredible job with its underbody armor. We also have underbody cameras, which can actually help you navigate around or above those big obstacles. With all our live camera feeds, it's like having a virtual spotter right inside the truck. Well, all these features we've talked about also translate into the Hummer EV being an awesome beast on the street as well. And those of you that know me know my passion for performance-oriented vehicles. But working on an EV has allowed our team to unleash capability we could only dream of before. So how do we harness this and unleash more than 1,000 horsepower and 11,500 pound-feet of torque? Zero to 60 in three seconds is thrilling enough for any vehicle, but how do we make it even more thrilling? Think of the way a roller coaster ride builds the anticipation. We wanted to generate those same feelings in the Hummer EV, and we do, thanks to what we're calling Watts to Freedom Mode. It's an interactive experience that engages the senses. The vehicle conditions its electronics and establishes the ride height for the lowest possible center of gravity. At the same time, you hear this awesome 14-speaker Bose sound system belt out cool music, and when the customer sees arm, your excitement reaches its peak. That's what Watch the Freedom is all about, delivering the unbridled acceleration only possible with an EV, and completely unexpected for a vehicle of this size. So as fun as Watch the Freedom and going fast are, it's also about delivering exceptional ride and handling. Torque vectoring gives you a more balanced and seamless experience Add to that precise steering control, along with four-corner air suspension and four-wheel steering, and the Hummer EV provides exceptional vehicle balance and control. I remember the first time I drove an electric vehicle. Since that moment, I've been convinced that EVs are the way of the future. I've subsequently led the charge that not only can you have an awesome vehicle that rivals its internal combustion counterparts, but one that massively raises the bar while creating a more sustainable future. It's simply a better experience. Instant torque, crazy power, Ultium fast charging capability. And the structure is now one with the propulsion system. The GMC Hummer EV is a super truck that will change perceptions about what an electric vehicle is. And it'll lead us all into a zero emission future. I'd like to introduce you to the Hummer EV. Now this is the first vehicle to use GM's Ultium platform. The heart and soul of this system is a 24 module double stack battery system the sheer power of the Ultium battery pack enables off-road and performance features that will really set us apart. And we can cool and control these batteries with our architecture for even more performance from special driving modes like terrain to watts to freedom. But I think the coolest part of the Ultium system is the battery management system, which debuts on the Hummer EV. And the speed and robustness of communications really sets it apart from a wired system. And the Ultium platform takes this technology and creates something that we like to call universal charging. We can charge just about anywhere. You can go all the way up to 800 volts and 350 kilowatts on a DC fast charge. This will actually get you about 100 miles charge in only 10 minutes. But Tim, why do I even need that? With 350 miles of range, that's more than enough to get me to any of the major off-road trails at national parks where I can go mountain biking or hiking. And one of the neat features here is that when you're up high on a hill and you're coming down the hill to get home, we'll actually generate electricity on the way down. And all this happens through the Ultium drive units. The motor in the front is actually combined with a locking differential for the rock crawling. The rear motors can work in concert with that independently on the driver's side versus the passenger side to give you real control and torque vectoring. Now, with all this capability, you have to make sure that no matter what, these systems are durable. And you have to control all of this torque and all of these different modes of operation with confidence. 
And our pure EV propulsion system also holds torque for much longer and through a wider range of speeds than even diesel engines, which is great for both on and off-road. The Hummer EV will be the first GMC to offer Super Cruise, the hands-free driver technology that works on over 200,000 miles of highways in North America. And remember I said zero compromise? So with that in mind, we've added automatic lane change, and to bring the Hummer EV and the outside world together is our e-assist app. This allows monitoring of the vehicle's energy usage, along with setting up a charging schedule, conditioning the battery temperature on the way to the charging station, and teaching you how to drive more efficiently to maximize your range and more. All of these cutting-edge EV technologies were aimed at one goal, to deliver the ultimate expression of off-road capability and performance. Well, Mike, you've certainly encountered your fair share of tough obstacles over the years. How will the Hummer EV's four-wheel steering and crab walk help customers navigate through tight places? Yeah, you know, prior to my racing, I started out in rock crawling. And I actually had a vehicle that had four-wheel steer. So what we did is we created multiple steering modes on the Hummer EV, including crab walk, to make that a lot easier for the customer and more intuitive to navigate tight places. Well, crab walk is an awesome feature, but four-wheel steer is also going to be great on-road. Aaron, tell us a bit about your off-road experiences and the example we talked about earlier. I love challenging myself on trails. On a recent trip to Windrock Park last June, I had to navigate a turn with a very aggressive side slope combined with about a five-foot vertical wall. Thankfully, I got out with only a cracked tail lamp. 